What is going on guys? Thank you for joining us. This is episode 1 of my series with Riga United. Now if you didn't see the introduction, it is in the description below, so check that out. Now we're going to have look, look back at pre-season and see exactly how we did. Then I'm just going to show you the start line for today and we're going to get into today's match. The other episodes, as we go on through the season, we will look to see who's performing well, who is impressing me, who's not impressed me. But for now, we're just going to get into it. Um, I'll switch this to goal score so you can see. So we start off with a 2-2 draw at home to SFK. Um, Karim and Del Campo with the goals. And then we got a 3-1 victory against Ogre. We had um, Montalto... Kareem and Marco Spinola. Then we got nil nil draw at home, and then we finish with another home game, and we and we got one 0 victory against RFS with Salvis Lictis scoring the goal. Um, obviously all all games were at home, but I needed some uh, revenue, and we got a couple of thousand from them games, so happy with that. Just quickly show you transfers. We had one transfer happen over. The summer, a young Russian centre midfielder, 23 years old, a really good player. He's, as you'll see, he's actually previous club is Jamala, who we are due to play today in the cup. So hopefully he can do well against his previous employers. On to the starting lineup for today. So let's have a look at that now. Okay, here you go. As you see, we're going to be playing a 4-4-2. Um, we're going to play Murad in goal. Then we've got Odod, Lictus, Labonte and Brew at the back. Then Montalto, Galbov, Hartwig and Gloria on the left wing. And then we've got Gulo and Del Campo up front. Um, on the bench, we are going to be running with uh, Mo Wanda, Savakis, Anton, Tilvan Swarman, Cozzers, Snickers, Spinoza and Serrado. Um, um, other breaking news I want to pick out is Graham Williams has retired from football. Um, he was our first choice reserve goalkeeper. Um, but I needed a reserve team manager and Graham Williams fit the bill. Um, he was the best person we had available at the club to step into that role. Um, due to the ginormous size of our reserve team which you will see I want to focus quite a bit on the reserve team and want to see exactly how well they can do and um, we have a lot of players and some of them will be stepping up to the first team if they're performing well enough so my plan is obviously to keep a close eye on it as we go on so I'm really happy that um, Graham Williams has accepted the role to become reserve team manager and they will be playing the, the Latvian reserves group 2 and you'll see the teams are going to be up against here. So hopefully they can pick up a few victories and win the win the title would be fantastic. I was just win the title. I was going to say hopefully we can finish in the top half and push on from there. As you can see, they've actually played one game already, and they won the game 2-1. So that was fantastic against Salzburg's reserves. But let's get into today's match. Sorry if I just waffled on a bit there. Hopefully we can get the victory today. It's going to be a tough game away from home. I'm not expecting miracles, but if we can get a victory, it would be obviously fantastic. Just a couple of tactical changes here, just to make sure everyone's in the squad who I want to be in the squad. Our first game in the Latvian Cup, and we are away from home. Jamal are a tough side, so I have no idea how this is going to go, if we're going to impress or not. Glory with the ball. Oh my God, Kareem. We are 1-0 up away from home. Golu. Fantastic. I can't believe this. 1-0 up. What a volley. What a volley that was. Fair play. 10 minutes in. We are still leading. They have had four shots. Two, two on target. We've had one. Oh, they hit the bar there, but we got cleared. They're leaving three back. I move has collected that well in. Just take your time, pal. Take your time. Just gonna drop it to counter. We one nil up away from home. Just make sure we don't all go gung ho pushing up. Be fantastic if we can get a really good solid victory here. 
move it out to Ardod. Ardod of Gloria in the half rig. What a player this is. Del Campo. Oh, lucky. Come on. Right, Bruce picked it up. Motalto, Hatvig, Del Campo, Del Campo, oh my days, I can't believe it. We are winning 2 0 away from home in the cup. Oh my days, what a. Watch this, Hatvig here. Lays up Del Campo, he takes a touch and then he just buries it bottom corner. The five crowd which are watching are going to be impressed. Curious to see what the attendance is at half time, it will be revealed. Come on, let's just not concede now. Get into half time with the 2 0 lead. It's all I want at this type of situation. Brew there, come on. Bit of a panic, panicky clearance. They told to play the ball short, so I'm a bit confused why he's just kicking it long. Decisions. Move out there, has picked it up though. Come on, distribute correctly. Looks like we're going to get in with a 2 0 at half time. Fantastic. Right, come on. Um, yep, yeah, very happy with how things are going. I just want to um, be more disciplined. I was put on being more disciplined for now. I don't want to be demanding too much step by step. Come on, playing some really good passing football. 297 fans have turned out to watch the match in the Latvian Cup first round. Free kick. Is he off? Is that his second yellow? It is. They're down to 10 men. This is getting better for us. We could be progressing in the next round here. I was so unsure how this game was going to go, but we have played well. Ball in. Oddard. Tell what I'm going to do. Oddard's going to come off because um, it is stupid to go to 10 against 10 at this situation. So just keeping it safe and taking off the only player who's on a yellow card. And... Also, I'm going to bring on our young German because he's our free kick specialist. So I think it'll be a perfect time and situation to bring him onto the left wing. Because it only takes now one situation to put us 3 0 up and give proper daylight between them. I mean, as you'll see, they've had 13 shots to our 7. We've had 3 shots on target and scored 2 goals. They've had 7 shots on target. But we've had 56% possession so far, so we're playing well with the ball. We're just not getting our, the shots away. Um, come on, Del Campo. Oh, what a ball. Just spreading the play beautifully. Down the wing. Please finish this off after this play. Oh, my days, we are 3-0 up. Riga United 3, Jamala 0. Oh, what a play that was from the spreaded ball from Del Campo. Getting down the right wing after that. Then it's all the way across for our young German on his wrong foot just to knock it in. Just as that happens, Karim has picked up a knock. So I'm going to bring on Roman Sar Sarando on the right wing. I can't believe we're 3-0 up. Really can't believe how well we've played. Awesome play. So, I mean, there's 10 shots now. We've had 6 on target. 3-0 up. They've had 50, 16 shots. Well in. Great, solid defending again. Del Campo again with a beautiful ball. The Brew just knocks it. Oh, Drew there with a sloppy pass, but again Del Campo, he picks it up, he holds the ball up and then he's spreading the play. That's what you want. 
As the opposition comes across the field to close you down in this side, he's spreading the play off to the other side and it's just open every time. Great link up play. And we got the victory 3 0 in the opening game of this series. Very happy with the result. So now we'll just have a look at the the fixtures coming up and we'll decide when we're gonna come back and when we're gonna review how the players have started so far this season. Um I think we're gonna come back for Saldus at home because that gives a good few games of the league so we can get a a good idea of how the league's going to pan out, hopefully. So I'd like to thank you for listening. If you enjoyed it, please leave a like below. Please subscribe, and I will see you next time.